definition is this. I'll say her name, I'll say Kincaid's name, and I'll say any council person's name here. Now that's the most ignorant thing she's doing I ever seen from Councilman grown May, folks. In all I'm asking is that we respect I'm, each other and, and just make your point. You're Don't directing talk. the respect to the wrong person. When I okay. got the floor and she interrupts, she's out of order. Make your point. I, I've been making it okay. until I was rudely interrupted by Miss okay. Poplar with her politics. They and them ain't cut the weeds. They the administration. She supports them, and now she's getting antsy because I'm pointing my thing at Wallen and city administrator as far as who cuts the breeze. We cannot order employees to do nothing. It's in the charter. All we can do is request it. We can request and inquire. But I want it known clearly that I've been inquiring about these weeds for two months. We was cut first and that Wallen and the people who support him, Poplar and them, have dumpsters and all kind of action in her ward. And then for political reasons, we're neglected. And I understand that clearly in a political election season. And I don't bite my tongue about what I see. And that's why she acts like that, because it's clear Council what her and folks is doing. So, Miss. Um, Henderson, I do know what the ordinance said, and I ask that it be brought to these meetings because we don't have legislative no more. I used to chair that. We need to amend that ordinance because we don't even have the equipment to enforce it. Now, maybe I'm wrong, but I think I'm right. I bet you the ordinance say that the city of Flint abates that and then deal, builds the property on it. And if you find out that's a fact, then we must immediately change that <coughs> ordinance because it's unenforceable because we don't have the equipment to uh, abate it. 